innovation and creativity are two important aspect for any engineers to progress you may take any product you are currently using see the way it has evolved we take telephone for example how was the telephone in the 80s absolutely manual like people never thought that a telephone could be mobile then we had through innovation and creativity somebody brought in a mobile device but those that mobile device was very limited in its functionality so people further thought about a lot of things and then suddenly uh, we had a device called palm in between and palm gave you the touch ability to a phone so that's how touch phone started then further innovation and creativity led to um, smartphones so you had blackberry which was actually meant for emails so blackberry ensured that all your emails did did not miss you and you, you were involved in the emails and it was specifically designed to capture your emails when that internet evolution was happening now where are blackberries they are not there the innovation led to smartphones and smartphones virtually gobbled up most of the devices you don't have digital cameras today because you can take pictures in smartphones you don't have voice recorders because you can do voice recording in smartphones you can do whatever it takes in a smartphone today and how did the smartphone really come about it's purely through creativity and innovation so every time there is a change in your device or in any product it's an outcome of a creativity or innovation a progress so innovation and creativity is for progress for change which we without which we cannot um, grow so for your growth for the progress you need creativity and innovation this is only example of a telephone you look at the cars how was the car in the 80s how are the cars today in fact we are talking about a big change in the way we are going to operate cars we are moving from ic machines to electric vehicles and the entire maintenance of the car can be done remotely today you don't need to take it to a workshop because everything is done through the computer so the interoperability the the innovation the the the, the way the car is created it's the outcome of again creativity and innovation so there is absolutely no doubt that as an engineer you need to have creativity and innovation to progress further uh, look at apple apple came up with all iconic products like when when we first heard music we had a tape recorder then you have walkman and then apple came up with the ipod now the iphones these are all again outcomes of creativity and innovation with the prime goal of creating something unique and we are also progressing because of that so to conclude creativity and innovation leads you to growth and better progress